we have come a long way to be where we are today, from shy students to the confident journalists, from the confines of our comfort zones to rattling the status quo. Indeed, it has been quite a journey. On that nostalgic note, let's all take a walk down memory lane and look at these moments that we created. Another turning point, a fork stuck in the road. Time grabs you by the rest, directs you where to go. Pass up the extraordinary narcissistic pleasures. We had uh, uh, six bright students last year, but the transformation when they joined and when they left the college was superb. Navanita was, uh, from the time she came, uh, she was full of life and uh, she, uh, it was uh, good to see somebody who was so well informed. I think that was a great thing. For instance, uh, Khushbu was uh, knowledgeable but she did her research well. Pavani was uh, pretty quiet and she hardly used to talk much. But, uh, I think she changed over after some time. Then you'd have Abdul who'd wait for his turn, but when he would say something, he would say something uh, uh, which uh, made a lot of sense. So funny uh, was quite initially, but if you talk about politics, he really used to talk a lot on that. Uh, Jisho, I didn't get to work with uh, too much, uh, but the little that I got to work with Jisho, Jisho was uh, very sweet, very understanding. It's something unpredictable, but in the end it's right. I hope you had the time of your life. We did this internship in Sakshi TV in Andhra Pradesh, in Telugu of course, the language is comfortable in. And uh, now I was told that he's getting into Studio N as a reporter. And afterwards, she joined the Mangalam group as a reporter there. She writes a lot and she, I was told, uh, people who go through her stories say that her Malayalam um, is very good. And again, from a shy girl, not confident girl, to a confident person, she can take on any other job. Hello and welcome to the NSOJ News Summary. I am Abdul Aziz. At the end of the uh, uh, course, he was much more confident and uh, she could get into any uh, TV channel or uh, as a photograph uh, in a magazine that takes care of photography can do that. Hello and welcome to NSOJ News Summary. I am Pavni Kutanti. The transformation what I saw when she joined and when she left again, she was a very, very confident girl, can take up any job. You may not believe she is doing a job of a reporter in Metro today in Andhra Pradesh now. And when I keep in touch with her, I'm enjoying my role as a journalist. And welcome to a summary of the latest news around the world. I'm Kushbu Anita. And she had an internship in Times of India. On the second day of her joining as an intern, her byline appeared in Times of India. It is not easy. Only when you are a good reporter, when you are confident and the seniors know what you are, then they give byline. You have to earn a byline. Byline is not given as a, a ch charity. You have to earn that byline and she did that. She's one of my best uh, students of last year. Hello and welcome to NSOJ News Summary. I am Namrita Shavastav. Improved a lot as far as television is concerned. Apart from television, whatever she did, anchoring and uh, video editing and other things, she was good in writing also, particularly travel pieces. And I, you may not believe, I told her, write travel pieces, whatever you want. I will keep the last page of NSOJ post for you. It is your responsibility and you may not believe it, she delivered. It's something unpredictable, but in the end it's right. I hope you had the time of your life. I'm sure this has brought back a whole lot of memories.
bittersweet experiences. Times, guys have, you guys had lunch together. Times, you broke news together. Oh, the times, the times. And here we are now, facing yeah. the realities of life. More knowledgeable from our experiences, our highs and lows.